Hey, what's up, nerds? Today, we're going to step into the Wayback Machine and talk about Legions. It was the third set in the Onslaught block, and it was the first set to feature only creatures, which sounds pretty cool. All right, team, that's right. Legions today. I actually uh, decided to make this video because I picked up a pack of Legions in a magic lot that I purchased. We're going to talk about whether or not I got scammed here in a minute. Legions is from the Onslaught block, and it was the third set, I believe. It was a small set, only about 140, what was it, 145 cards. It was the first creature-only set. Has there been another creature-only set? I'm not exactly sure. But it was released way back in February of 2003. Going way back to February of 2003, well, my first son, who is now 20, going on 21, was born six months from then. I was teaching full-time and also a grad student in the school counseling program at the University of Kansas. Yeah, so that was a hot minute ago. Legions was focused on tribal, of course, because it was, I mean, Typal, what do they call it now? It was focused on creature types. So there was different creature types, and it did feature the comeback of slivers. Yeah, everybody loves slivers, right? I had no idea what slivers were. The mechanics that I find most notable from the set were double strike. It was introduced double strike, which is great. A creature gets first strike and regular strike. That's pretty awesome. Uh, there were morph triggers, so you had cards that would like face up, face down, you know, change. Kind of hooked those in because there were no spells in the set, so it kind of gave you that. Still that feel that magic could happen. Um, Provoke was also featured in the set. Some of the notable cards include Akroma, the Angel of Wrath, Caller of the Claw, who doesn't want a bonus 2-2 Grizzly Bear, the Goblin Goon, <laughs> and, in my opinion, the absolute triumphant return of the White Knight, although I want to know where my Black Knight is. Any Black fans, right? Like I said, I got this pack. It's part of a lot on eBay. I'm a little worried that it was already opened. I will show you the deep. I got this pack <laughs> uh, right side up. I'm a little worried that it was already opened, but hey, here goes. Let's see what we got. Oh, um, yes, this pack. Why do I think it might have already been opened? It's got this weird crease down at the bottom, which I don't know how you crease a pack like that with the card still in it. I guess it's possible. It just seems strange. It also was kind of split up here in a way. I don't know. I'm not really a pro at determining these things. So let's find out if... I mean, if I pull, like, a Chroma or whoever, then I guess I win, right? I have no idea where the rares are. We're just going to go for it. Oh, I guess these are probably the commons, right? Because they were doing colors then. Hmm. Retro Borders for the win. He's got the Provoke. Theft Blade Elite. Oh man, look at that art. The embra embalmed brawler. <laughs> Skirk Marauder. Looking at these old cards. Glintwing Invoker. The Goblin Turncoat. <laughs> Sacrifice a goblin to regenerate him. That feels on point. Nantuko Vigilante. Insect Druid Mutant. Yeah, let's just throw it all out there. Morph, I don't understand. You turn it face down as a 2-2 two -two creep. You can play it face down. So they didn't actually have a back to the morph cards. You just played them face down as a 2-2 two -two creature. And then you could morph it later on. Huh, okay. Kenai Avon. Wingbeat Warrior. Goblin Firebug. <laughs> so much fun for me. Oh, look at that art on that guy. Skirk Outrider. A lot of goblins, huh? Infernal Caretaker. Just take a good long look at that guy's head. What a weirdo. He's a cleric, though. Stoic Champion. Now that's pretty cool. He's got like a mirrored shield. And you can see the skill boy that's coming to get him. Love it. I guess he's he's our first uncommon. Gem Palm Incinerator. 
Yeah, the gem palms were a thing. Skirk Drill Sergeant. I think I can have a whole goblin deck just from this pack. And finally, our rare is the Sunstrike Legionnaire. I mean, they were all in the right order. I'm going to just assume I didn't get screwed. Jeez, the card quality was just so much better. Just like, there's no question of centering or misprint. These are gorgeous cards. Legions, that was really fun. I really enjoyed those cards. I love looking at old cards and just how bold the borders were, how rich the colors were. <sighs> anyway, nostalgia, even nostalgia that wasn't my nostalgia feels good sometimes. You guys have a great weekend. You're awesome. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon.